Hello and welcome back to episode 37 of my Let's Play the Grand County of Sterling campaign. Last episode, we um, signaled the death bell for the Counts of Sylvania. We're going to have to finish him up. Wonderful. We're going to have to try to finish him up within the next couple of turns before they can regain their strength. Well, that might be tough given the situation within the other parts of our county. Sigma, drop I mean, this thing. Show me your over. weapons and march out. Yeah, no. We'll send. We await you to take in your grandma, Lord. We'll just send whatever yeah, troops we Lord. can for despair. The faithful shall prosper. It shall be so. There will be no okay, rest while one army. foe draws breath. Ooh, what's this? Soldiers from Castle Drakenhof. Defeat is impossible. So yeah, we'll wait till next turn and then we'll the darkness shall not defeat us. Attack whatever's left over there. Hopefully we're bad and survive a couple of turns. Because now they're under siege and they have a play going on within the I settlement. Shall make a stand here. So that's not good. And we've been attacked again. By Sylvania. Uh, no, not very many archers. That's a worrisome unit, and their general's pretty worrisome, but not many archers. We could do this the battle. Enemy will pay with their blood. I didn't see the other army there. That's gonna suck. So I'm pretty sure we're facing two armies, not just one, like everything we thought. So I'll pull my army up, but if it ends up we will, we are facing two armies, I might just retreat from the battle. Does not appear to be the case. So we'll form up a weird looking little thing. Uh, we got. We have one, oh, we only have one unit of spearmen. Oh, you'll go on left flank, along with the swordsmen that we have left. And then the actual unit of swordsmen, like the full unit, we'll put over here. The amount of, like, all these archers survived the last battle, and it's pretty impressive. We'll go here. The general will go back here. I believe that's everybody. Now we just have to wait for an enemy to get within range and destroy them. Okay, we got this full regiment of halberdiers still. But I, but I called it back in before we ended our turn, or else this battle would end up vastly different. I believe when I have like one unit of archers. Oh, I've got two units, so that's pretty good. Are these the Grave Guard Halberdiers? No, zombies, zombies. The Grave Guard. Uh, where are they? Where are they? They're one of. Yep, yeah, normal Empire Halberdiers, too. Hmm. Huh. I thought I've ever seen Grave Guard. Oh, here they are. And if their general goes in first, that's actually better because their human, the most like their human component of their army, the most dangerous part, I suppose, will just rout, and that'll be good for us. There we go. Now we have missile superiority. Missiles we have left can be devoted to the rest of our army. Oh, there's not many graveyard. I thought there was a lot more than that. Uh, oh, if 
they're waiting for the zombies to get in position, that's gonna be better for us. You know, they'll just take massive casualties because of that. Oh, here they come. A couple of free company. Some skeleton spears, the halberdiers. Mostly, that looks like a lot of swordsmen, to be honest. That's what I was not expecting. Uh oh. They're going back into formation. Actually, wait. Oh, we don't have very much ammunition. So what is the Let's just try and use attack now. I'll probably either charge or just keep shooting at them from behind. Charge. Because those hobbies aren't going to do anything anytime oh. quickly. We'll get out of there because our own archers are still firing. Oh, all that's left is a gem. Interesting. And once he's gone. I guarantee you anything that's alive in the zombie is probably gonna rout. Especially if I just charge him slightly from behind. These guys get away, so we're just gonna capture them. Uh oh, I guess right into the zombies. I mean, if we don't get all of it, we don't get all of it. But we're gonna have to try and get most of it. And without muting the sound constantly. And then we're just gonna see if it sits. We're gonna definitely need a good retrain of the army after this. Once we capture Dragon Hop, we probably use the facilities there at the castle just to retrain most of the troops. Ah, never a victory. It's good, always good to get a victory in the lift belt. Only 30 of them got away, so probably destroyed the army anyway. Good. You can't kill what 
Hmm, money's tempting, but we're gonna have to make sure there's no one left. Oh my goodness. I have to see what the Ever Army's made of because I don't remember seeing it previously. And since it's there now, that's not a good idea. Oh. That actually works out pretty well. Whatever my ally does not manage to kill, I'll be there to finish off. That's very nice of Everland to come and help me after, you know, stealing my land for so long. But no. It's just good to see the AI is actually helping out ever um, Empire factions when they need it. Because I'm pretty sure that AI does this for ever AI factions too. Oh god. That was loud. That's not the timer, that was... That was a test of the timer system. <laughs> uh, this is what we were supposed to be getting in work bad soon, but I don't recall if I built the armor factory or not. I'm coming right behind them. Okay. I'm just gonna hide near the edge of the map. Let's see what they can do. Everline, why are Oh my goodness, the archers are so close to the enemy. Oh they have their own special halberdiers. That pikemen. No, oh, there's also Everland's heavy halberdiers, but it doesn't look like they actually have any. Here, we can move up. History, right there. <clears throat> so we can kill them. The rest of the armor probably route. Unless the enemy or my ally loses his general, which is extremely likely. Okay, so we got some desolators and their general's bodyguard coming towards us. We didn't take a lot of casualties from the general's bodyguard. That will be able to do quite a lot of fire on. He's gonna lose his general at this rate. Falcon's doing over here. Looks like they're they've destroyed most of the Chaos Armor already. Wow. Oh. And I didn't even pay attention to that. Well, Chaos is finished, this army at least. It's extremely nice of everyone to come and help out. Oh great. Is that it's their general I'm gonna kill my eyes general, aren't I? 
Okay, you guys stop that. I think those guys ran off to some other part of the map that looks like. What? What's going on up here? I don't I don't understand what the AI is doing. They're gonna kill their own general for that range fire. I'm gonna start killing my men. Goodness, you just killed six of my men. Oh my goodness. Here, you guys can open fire on them again. This one Chaos Champion is causing so much damage to the two out, to the two armies. It's unreal. I mean, at this rate, you probably will. I kind of like a unique character to take up so much damage, otherwise this just does not seem like this should be the case. There we go, finally. This champion of chaos is gone, Johannes of Varg. The only off for you, man. That works out well. nothing but victories for the last couple episodes and last couple turns it seems for Sterling and our allies. I mean Voidabrigan might fall to chaos but who knows it might not. If it does we'll take it instantly in a heartbeat because you know even out the borders a bit to make it look nice. Okay so I got this army which actually has some pretty decent units somehow. And I got that army. What is your command, General? We have your own And we're just gonna wait to see. The enemy will pay in blood! Oh I shall God. storm the stronghold! They get the massive amounts of events spawn troops because they're under siege. Huh. I don't want to build that yet. Uh, just want to try and get whatever we can. I want to just face the beastmen. I prefer to remain that way for never a little while. Um, do we have any troops? No, that's pretty much everything that we can call upon. Hmm. Wonderful. The God shall judge us on our deeds this day. I would not spend eternity with you. Let Sigma guide us. Oh my goodness. Defeat um, is impossible. Yeah, cancel siege, my sword arm is Unfortunately, strong. I still have all the troops from the event spawn, but. Oh my goodness. Oh, Voiderbringer just fell. I'll just retreat from Sylvania and probably go take Voiderbergen for now. Get yeah, right here. A weapon is useless. I shall make a stand here. Oh my goodness. Hmm. I'm gonna leave this episode here. I did a batch recording today, so I don't wanna make mistakes because I'm just tired. I wanna get the fruit about quickly. So leave a like, comment, or if you're feeling generous, a subscription. And I shall see all of you in the next episode.